Hey, what's up, guys? I got Ian here from Petopia, Mr. Owner of the store, the establishment, and we're gonna talk to Ian. He's gonna tell us about his store and uh, everything about it. All right, here we go. What's up, Ian? Not too much. All right, tell us uh, tell us about Petopia. Uh, Petopia started a little over a year ago, about 14 months ago. Excellent. Built from scratch here. Uh, came back to town, started a little pet store, full line store. We've got everything except for dogs and cats, but we do puppy adoptions on Saturday. Excellent, excellent. Why is puppy adoption so uh, important? Um, the dogs that come here are dead row dogs. They're on the last chance. If they don't um, find a home on Saturdays, they get put down the following week. Oh, so we do sucks. everything we can to stop the animals from getting put down and everything else. One of the reasons we won't actually sell dogs is because we don't want to add to that problem. There we go, there we go. That's why it's important to keep animals safe. <laughs> um, all right, let's take a walk through the store and you tell us, you know, some about, about some of your animals and everything. Sure. Let's go. Come on. I'm gonna follow you. In. Ugh. What do we got here? Uh, these are the small animals we've got. So we keep um, like little dwarf panthers. Those things are tiny. Tiny, tiny, tiny but sweet. Most of them. Like them. Awesome. Oh. See, I think we should get five stars just for that. <laughs> and we also have regular hamsters. Cool. Very cute, very cute. So we have a wide selection of small pets mm -hmm. to get kids early, early in to loving animals. And my favorite pet? What is that? It's a Dumbo rat. That is cool. These are sweet. They don't bite, they make great pets, take them for walks. You can throw them on girls, freak them out. That can happen, too. <laughs> cool. I see you got a. Uh, you got bird treats, you got bird toys, mm -hmm. cages. Cages for everything. I see we got a fish section. Mm -hmm. This is where I got my fish tank from. My monstrous 55 gallon fish tank. Yep. Now we keep everything for all What's the up? Fish. Say hello, YouTube. Hello, YouTube. Alright, good times. <laughs> now we keep all the filters, we keep every part and caboodle you can think of for salt water, fresh water, pond, you name it. See that, guys? See that? Ian's got it. You got to come down to Milledgeville, swing by, and come to Petopia. Wide selection of the beta fish. Beta fish. Saltwater fish. Awesome. You got some sea anemones in there. Mm -hmm. I, I think I said it right. You did. <laughs> that so is very cool. Full range of anemones. We got freshwater fish, goldfish, tropical fish, African cichlids, saltwater fish, okay. fish, corals. Keep the whole nine yards. We've got all the stuff from every fish food you can think of, all the chemicals, everything to make the reef tank, make it a reef. Nice. Sea salt. Wow. I didn't know that. Mm -hmm. no, we keep it all. Very cool. Yeah. You even do grooming, don't you? We do. We do grooming Monday through Friday. we got a great groomer named Ashley. She grooms every type of dog there is, except for cats. All right. <laughs> and then we have a whole reptile section. Cool. We keep all the basic snakes from ball pythons to rosy boas, red tail boas, bearded dragons, hissing cockroaches. Blech. Always a personal favorite. Oh. I use these on all See my. See guys, I'm not a fan of bugs. <laughs> I use these on all my field trips. Very cool. And we usually keep tarantulas in here, but I do a couple of field trips a week with um, the local um, elementary school kids that come in here about 20, 30 at a time. All right. They can't afford to really go anywhere else, so hey. they bring them to the pet store. Sounds good. We can keep fire belly toads. Cool. Mm -hmm. and then we got all the stuff for all the reptiles, of course. Uh-oh. That sounds like Molly. That is Molly. Molly's going crazy. She's camera shy. Okay. Yeah, she's definitely camera shy. And then we keep birds. Keep only little birds. I don't do big birds. Too loud. <laughs> but I keep finches and I keep parakeets in. These are the zebra finches. Yeah, these things are cool. I call them the squeaky birds. Mm -hmm. What's up? They freak out. And I'll take a bath. They're all happy. Uh. They seem like they spook very easy. Very easy. That's the finch world. <laughs> They're for looking, not for biting. <laughs> and my favorite animal. The birds. Favorite pet? Yeah, guys, you saw this the the ferret video for the win. You guys saw that. I, I'll put up a separate video just for other ferrets. Nice 
sleep very, very well. What a mess. What what a life. The life of a ferret. It is the life of a ferret. Oh, goodness. Oh, yeah. So Ian will be setting up a YouTube channel soon for Petopia. And uh, I'll be linking everybody to that. As of right now, you can check in the description for all the information on how to get here. The phone number, the fax number, if you have any questions, you can just uh, give them a call. Uh, I don't think it, I don't put, I didn't put email up there yet. I kept it private. But uh, <laughs> they can all call you. They can fax you. Mm -hmm. And what are your hours? Hours are Monday through Friday, 11 to 7, and Saturday, 10 to 6. That's excellent. Five stars for Petopia. Hey. Take it easy, guys.